how do you uh, feel knowing that you're the one of the recipients this year of the uh, Kent State Advocacy Award? Um, very humbled uh, when you think of the thousands of all alumni that uh, have graduated from Kent State University and uh, that are so supportive of our university. That then uh, to have me s us singled out um, uh, it is very humbling. I am. I'm honored. It's. I would have never thought in my lifetime when I attended Kent State University that this day would have ever happened, let alone, you know, having it occur. So yeah, this is this is very nice. Describe Larry and Sandy Disbro. Well, if uh, something needs to be done, they certainly get it done. They uh, work with each other beautifully. Describe Larry. Oh, well, uh, Larry. Um, does a very nice job in anything he does, whether it's at work or whether it's involved with an organization you know, such as the Kent State Alumni Association. Sandy is, um, uh, she's probably a little more humble than I am. She's uh, uh, behind uh, the scenes again. She's the, she's the workhorse. She really gets things. I'm more the idea guy and, and she puts the, <laughs> and she, she implements. How do Larry and Sandy represent or reflect Kent State? Well, in everything they do, I mean, um, they're usually wearing Kent State apparel. <laughs> um, I would say that I was uh, uh, golden born and flash is bred. I'll bleed blue and gold until I'm dead. Whenever you talk with them, um, something comes out about Kent. They, uh, it's not in the back of their mind, it's right in the front. And Kent was playing a football game and they won their last football game and I see people walking down Summit and they're carrying the goalpost. I think it's very well deserved. They just, uh, every time I talk to Sandy, it's, oh, Larry's at Kent, or he says, oh, I got a meeting at Kent. He they live here and they do the sports all the time and they just like to be on campus and they certainly deserve this award and I'm so happy to hear that they're getting it. Well, um, it, it, I, I guess it, it validates um, the hard work we've, we've put in, but what it really does, it uh, inspires me to, to, to keep at it. Uh, that, that's the piece that really means a lot, that, uh, that we're, we're doing the right things for this university. And, um, uh, that's why I, I, I really appreciate the fact of being this, this honor. You know, you don't, you don't always get awards for doing things, you just go through the rhythm of doing something and if something does happen, it happens, but never in my lifetime I thought it would be for Kent State University. <laughs> Is there anybody, anybody out there that you want to thank or acknowledge? Well, uh, the Kent State University Alumni Association uh, to begin with, um, thank you so much. Uh, this was, uh, again, a great honor. I want to thank my professors and, and uh, for everyone that's, that's supported me and as well as um, you know, Lake County chapter has is, is really got us involved back into the, into the main campus. I'd like to thank my wife Sandy uh, and our daughter Kelly, uh, again, um, all advocates for Kent State University. Uh, we uh, um, kind of a Kent State family.